Hello everyone, it is Replicas here and I'm back with another herping video. So, I have some things to talk about. The mating season of these common frogs has been pretty hard for these past days. It has been really, really cold, it has been almost snowing. And it has been really, really cold. So I haven't really seen many of them at one place. I haven't even heard any croaking. But there is actually two frogs down there. And there is lots of uh, frog spawn actually. Also in places where I haven't found any on the past years. But this season kind of sucks because I haven't really managed to get in any food from the frogs mating. I have some pictures I'm gonna show them to you guys at the end of the video or something but yeah I'm gonna check out some other places maybe we will actually hear some frog croaking or e even see more frogs but yeah I'm gonna be right back so there's another frog over here in this pond um, there isn't any frog spawn in this one which is a bit weird um, there's one more pond behind me, that's the place where I found some frogs and lizards last year, so hopefully we will find some more. And also, it has been so cold that these frogs doesn't even care anymore, like, they aren't reacting at all to me. And uh, if you just saw the underwater footage I took with my camera, um, those two, two frogs, they didn't care at all, they didn't even try to run, so yeah, it's pretty darn cold, my hands are freezing, but yeah, I might try to get some videos from this guy, you know, a bit closer, so be right back. So there is at least two frogs in this pond, one is over there and one is somewhere over there, I think you are able to see him, somewhere over there, but there isn't actually any frog spawn in this pond either, which is pretty weird because it's a pretty big pond as you can see. And yeah, again the frogs don't really care about me, it has been so cold. So their mating season has been a little bit weird this year, which is sad. <coughs> but I'm gonna continue my journey over there, maybe I will find something else, maybe I will get some more footage underwater. I actually forgot to, um, what's the word, charge the underwater camera's battery, so I don't really have much of battery life left, but I'm gonna try to get something. First I'm gonna see if there's any lizards over here, I saw some last year, but yeah, be right back. So I did see some frogs in some ponds over there. But they were all hiding in the water, I couldn't really get absolutely any pictures. And some ponds were completely empty. So I'm gonna go to the ponds that I usually visit. I doubt that we will find much, but I guess I should try. But yeah, so let's get going I guess. So... Yeah, um... I guess these frogs are dead. I was here a couple of days ago. Also sorry about the noise on the background. But yeah, I was here a couple of days ago at this pond. And yeah, I saw these same two frogs. In the exact same position. I don't know how to pronounce that word. But they are still here at the same place. And... Hold on, my camera needs to focus. Come on, camera. Okay, this is seriously interesting. I'm pretty sure that the female, the one uh, beneath the other frog, is dead. I'm gonna look at its eyes. I'm pretty sure it's dead. It isn't making anything. Like, it, is, it isn't moving or breathing. Also, its colors have been washed away or you know they have gotten more light I think that's how you say it 
or describe it. They were a lot more brighter a few days ago. But the male, the guy we see, so see over here, he is alive. He's moving his legs and he's actually breathing. Um, it's kind of hard to see, but I just saw him breathing. But I have absolutely no idea what is happening. Yeah, now you can see he's actually breathing right there. Why, why is the male hanging on to a dead female? And why is the female dead? I'm gonna take them out of the water and see what I, what else I can find. Well, so here we go. As you can see, the male is clearly still alive. But I'm not sure about the female. Like, is it is it still alive? Is it going to some sort of hibernating state or something? But the female has been. Well, it's kind of hard to tell. I mean, describe. But this is so freaking weird because this is the same couple that I saw two days ago here. They were in the same spot. In the same position, position. I don't know how to pronounce that word, but yeah, what the heck? The male has just keeps on holding to the female. He isn't even trying to run away. He's just staying there when I'm holding these guys. I'm not even sure am I really allowed to hold them like this, but they aren't really doing anything. But yeah, the male is clearly alive. Let's see if we can. See the belly? The male is holding on, like that. I mean, it is normal for the males to grab onto the females. And maybe this guy... Well, I just don't know. But... I don't really know what to do either. I think that I'm just gonna put them back. When the male give up, gives up, he gives up. But yeah, really, really weird. The female is also pretty um, fat. I think she's... The eggs are still inside of her. But yeah, I'm gonna just put, them, put these guys back to the water after I get some pictures. And I think I'm actually hearing some croaking from there, so... I'm gonna be right back. So... There's so much frog spawn over here. Like, look at the amount of it. But the weird thing is, there isn't any, like, over there. Or over there. Like, this area is also separated so the tadpoles can't get over there. So, they might even die here. All the frog spawn, I mean. Because the water is gonna soon go away. Not all of it, but it's gonna dry. It's gonna moisturize in the, sorry, I mean, evaporate in the air, and there isn't gonna be any water left for the frog spawn, so they might try, and the frogs inside might die. So this is really bad. Not quite sure what kind of frog season it's gonna be this year, because all the frogs are like almost like frozen to death. And they have big weird places to lay their spawn in. So yeah. But yeah, there's quite a lot of it. But pretty weird place to, for them to, you know, do the spawn. I'm gonna check the places over there. And then I'm gonna leave. I'm getting a bit cold. But yeah, be right back. So I think that I'm gonna leave now. I don't think that I'm gonna find anything else. Although that in on the weekend I might visit the place where I found some common toads and an adder last year. Because the toads have made in season right now as well, so I might be able to find something. <laughs> if I'm gonna find some adult toads, that would be pretty darn awesome. But yeah, I have no idea what kind of frog season it's gonna be for me. Because there isn't any frog spawn in there. And there isn't any in there. Like, at all. Which is really weird, because they always lay their eggs in those ponds. But, on the other hand, I have seen lots of frog spawn in like little ponds. And when I say little, I really mean it like... If you see the power lines over there... 
there's like a, I don't know about, well, the power line itself goes for like 400 kilometers or something like that. But below it, there's like many little puddles, ponds, stuff like that. And the frogs have laid their spawn in there, but not in the big ponds, which is really weird. Also, the frogs are like frozen. I think many of them are dead, maybe. Maybe I'm just overreacting, but the female frog that the male frog was um, holding on to was definitely dead. I just don't think that it was alive anymore. And there also isn't any frog spawning there, which is also even more weirder because there is frogs over there. You might even see one as we walk by. I also saw some frogs mating here. So, yeah. Yeah, there's there's a frog over somewhere out there. So, have all the frogs died of cold? Because it has been pretty cold. Like, it was only... Yesterday it was only about plus 1 Celsius. And this morning it was minus 10. And it's, re it's colder than last year. And last year's last year, and so on. So, I guess this is the global warming. But I'm really worried what's going to go on. Maybe the frogs will lay more eggs in a week or so. Maybe they're just gathering more heat, you know. So they can lay more eggs. But, yeah. Thanks for watching, I guess. Leave a like if you enjoyed. And we should see more happy videos in the future. I think that I'm going to do some in the weekend. But, yeah. See you guys in the next video. Bye.